This is something you can simply do online through several websites, but the easiest is to use Companies House, as they are the government body that monitors all limited companies. To set your company up, you'll need to think of a few details first. A company name, something simple, it could just be your initials or something memorable. A company address, what do you want to be on the public records? Your director's details, have you decided who the directors are going to be? If you're setting up the business on your own, then this will just be you, and therefore, you'll just need to fill out all of your own personal details, your date of birth, your nationality, etc. Shareholders, you want the company to be limited by share capital so that you can take out the profits tax efficiently. The shareholders own the company and receive dividends. As with the director, you can start with you as a sole shareholder and you can choose the number of shares you want. If it's just you, one ordinary share of £1 is enough. A credit card. It costs £12 to register the company on Companies House. After you've done all this, Companies House will process the application. It'll take a few days and then they'll send your incorporation certificate, which your clients may need to see before signing a contract. You will also receive a six digit code through the post. Keep hold of this. You'll need this code whenever you want to sign into Companies House in the future. HMRC will then be automatically notified of your new company. They will write to you with your company's unique taxpayer reference, which you will need to be able to file a tax return in the next year.